Hamilton is undergoing a transformation. It's shifting from this industrial town to a hub of arts and culture. And with that comes a new niche, a new need arising. Brilliant, creative, radical, fresh voices are leaving in droves to these big, oversaturated urban centers. And they can't be blamed because like anyone else, you need to make a living, you need to buy groceries. There's no question that the industry is here now, but where is the consistent paycheck? Where are the long-term, buildable industry relationships? So the question becomes, how do we harness the power of these voices that are challenging the way that we make artistic work today while enabling them to stay here and make a living and to have stability and infrastructure. four of this area's theater programs, Brock and McMaster and, and Waterloo. So every so often there's this one kid that's just like stupendous and you're going, wow, this kid's gonna be fantastic. They finish school and I never see them again. The first thing they need to do in order to have a career and what they do is move away from here. And the advice I was given when we first started this project was take your budget and put it on marketing so that way everyone knows when everyone comes. So I didn't do that at all. <laughs> what I did is I took the money and said, how much can I pay my artists? How much can we give that artists can have a life where we live? So when you are here, so thank you, when you are here and you buy this ticket, you're buying their groceries. And that is ultimately the opportunity that we're all going to 